Marshalls and oh, what? Oh my God, this would have definitely broken. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If I look like I've been sleeping all day, it's because I was sleeping all day. I truly have just slept this entire day away. Let me see what time it is right now. Right now, it's 3.39. This morning, I woke up at like 8 o'clock and went to the Bronx to drop something off. Oh, hold on. Hello? Okay, thank you. Um, what was I saying? I went to the Bronx to drop something off. That was my husband just now, and I had to tell him, listen, tell the landlord he needs to come up here to come check on the heat because it is brick up inside of this apartment. And when you go out inside of, like, we live on the second floor. Outside of our door, there is the landing from the stairs. And then, you know, obviously the stairs to go downstairs. And that entire area is warmer than inside of this whole apartment. And there's even a skylight. Something is not working. Okay. Okay, see right now I'm, I'm fully dressed. Let me show you guys what I'm wearing. I have a clip from this morning that I'm gonna insert, but before we do that, I'm never this dressed when I'm home. This is too much clothes, okay? Okay. You have to be comfortable, but you wanna be cute. Anyways, so yeah. I was saying, I went to go drop something off in the Bronx and then came back, popped by the train station because I thought I had absolutely no money on my Metro card, which I do have some money on there. And that money that I have on there, she'll ask me for the rest of this year. Is how much money I have on there, 70 some dollars, 80 some dollars. I don't know why I thought I didn't have. Last night when I put it in the bus when I'm coming home from work, it said that I had 275 left and I'm like, oh, gotta go to the that didn't make any sense at all. Wow, and I'm just realizing that now. Great. Anyways, maybe I'll make some banana bread this evening. I don't really know. Since I just woke up, I haven't really fallen into the mood yet of cooking or anything at all. So, I need to see if I can catch that real quick. Also have two pots to wash that. My husband just left in here, which I'm very upset about. But it's okay. I really would have just loved to make some banana bread. But I really just, I'm not in the mood just yet. So I'm really trying to see if I can find that mood so I can make that. Because I'd really enjoy that this week. I have two coffee roll here because this morning I bought breakfast on the road. So I'm gonna have to eat one of this coffee roll. Let me turn this I'm gonna have to eat one of the coffee roll to see if it will pump my mood up just a little bit or something. Because right now, the mood that I'm in is to crawl back up in that bed and sleep for the entirety of this evening and that's not good okay so i have the banana here and they're nice and overripe but i also found some in the fridge in a little bag so i'm gonna use those first since i already have them in there frozen i should probably take them out a long time ago if i'm gonna use them and then i'll put those in bags and put them inside the fridge should take this out and like good bro I should, this is it, take this out, run some hot water in the bag for it to defrost. Oh, what is, oh, what that is? What am I even gonna make? What do I have in here? Shrimp, salmon, tilapia, chicken. Okay, chicken, great. I also have pork, maybe on the weekend. No, maybe on the weekend. I really just don't know. Like I'm saying, I really, I'm not in the mood. The pork has been marinating too for about a week at this point. It's been in there for a while. So now would probably be a good time to cook it, and it would probably taste really, really good if I cooked it now. But the way how the pork is set up, that just would not last any time inside here. So I think leaning more towards the chicken. So I'm going to take that out so it could defrost, and then I'm going to eat my coffee roll on the couch, in front of the TV, and see if I get in the mood while my stuff defrosts. I might also eat this. This Hagen does. Um, I don't know what this is called. I also have this ice cream. Let me put it out for a little bit. I'll eat that. And um, yeah. But I'm gonna figure it out right now and then we'll come back. Let me take the banana from here up so I don't forget that I said I was gonna put it to, to uh I was gonna put it in the fridge. 
feel like I'm not making any sense, but you know, I'll be like that sometimes. And I need to get the chicken out. That and I had chicken breast. What do I make with the chicken breast? Maybe some cabbage. Oh, I'll make that. The chicken breast looking like it's getting a little freezer burn because it's been in there for a minute. So I'll make that. I'll come back, you guys. I can't. <laughs> Obviously, I changed because the top that I was wearing, I did not want to get bleach on it. And based on what you guys saw, I had sprayed some bleach on the kitchen counter and like inside of the microwave and stuff like that. So I could clean it down, like give it a good wipe down. And it came all the way down to here. So me going around and like wiping up would have gotten bleach on there. And it was not ready for it to be old just yet. So I had to go and change it into something more comfortable. My robes are always comfortable comfortable at this point i need to get two more because i have two i just put one in the wash and whipped out this one a couple was yesterday i think it was yesterday and um yeah so i cleaned up around here it smells good in here it smells like bleach but it smells okay i have my candle here that i had um lit before the wax has already hardened this one i got from marshall's and oh what Oh my god, this would have definitely broken. Oh my god, I almost had a heart attack. That's crazy. This one is called Retrograde. And this one I got from Marshalls. And oh my gosh, it smells really, really good. I had said that I was going to buy some from Bath and Body Works. Because I have a coupon code for like 20% off. So I said that I was going to buy a few. But what I checked, this is very ghetto. But this is the size of the Bath and Body Works one. Let me hold this properly. Because obviously she'd be wanting to fall. And this is the size of the one I could get from Marshalls for $12. This is $12. This hair is $24.99. A lot of good deal. You could get it for like $14.99. Like right now they have it for $14.99. So I was thinking maybe I'd buy it now for $14.99. Because one thing about these ones, you really do smell them when you have them lit inside here. These, you smell them too. Don't get me wrong. But these are so much bigger. I feel like this is value for my money. The only difference is... With these ones, you know, there's no discount code to get nothing off at Marshall's. You know, you could really end up spending $100 very easy when it comes to um, Marshall's and stuff like that. But I feel like if I'm just buying candles, then I could buy like five of these big ones. And, um, like, it'll be good. Like, spend $70, buy five of these big ones, and I'd still be good. $14.99 times five. Too much money. But with a discount code, it's probably, I don't know. I don't know. So I'm still kind of torn because I still have the discount code every day. I set the reminder to remind me the next day to see if I still want to buy it. Maybe I'll buy it tonight when I'm leaning down on the couch. But, um, because you smell this, this is more of like a subtle scent. It smells really, really good, but it's more subtle. I think I might buy a few from Bath & Body Works still use 20% off um, discount code. But, um, right now it's 6.51. I went through and cleaned up so it smells nice in here and fresh. And I'm waiting for the landlord to come to figure out why it's cold as a in here. It ain't no reason why, and it's cold outside, okay? Today was in the 30s. I'm not gonna be playing with nobody that we're paying rent when the shit is gonna be cold. So, I'm waiting for him to come. I think my husband said he's gonna come at 7 o'clock. It's 6.52. So, in the next 8 minutes, I'll give him until like 7.30. Because, you know, obviously people have things doing to see what really is going on. But, um, for the most part, I'm gonna wrap up this vlog here. Thank you guys for chilling with me today after my long nap. I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'll see you guys in the next one.